Hey, it's late November and uh, we got lucky. It's a beautiful, beautiful day, but what do you do in November? I mean, you watch football, maybe you go hunting. The problem is um, there's no football on today and uh, I don't hunt, or maybe I do. Today, I'm going hunting with these bad boys right here, little coffee tubes with my buddy Simon the Iceman Frost, Great Lakes Smallmouth Super Smashing Specialist. <laughs> I've built it up. Now let's see if we can deliver. Should be very few goby bites if you get any. Water's too cold for them now. They go into hibernation. Oh, I missed one. You got him now. Well, remember that goby thing? I guess I lied. <laughs> you just gave me a big seminar. Yeah. About, yeah, you can't catch gobies this time of year. Because this goby didn't listen. <laughs> Go to sleep. That basically explains the entire sport of fishing. As soon as you think you know something, <laughs> yep. you don't. Possibly some fish on the bottom. Definite fish on the bottom. See how they're crawling? Those are all fish. Put their belly to the bottom. Come on, fish. Oh, that's a good fish. I knew about that bite. That was an awesome bite. You see, it's doing that really hard bite. But she came up, so it's a little bit better. It's a good one. Yeah, I find the ones that uh, stay down in dog are small, but the bigger ones, definitely smarter fish, they come right to the surface. Look at you, you're gonna get your hands wet. No, I'll grab the tube. <laughs> Water seems to be a little bit stained today. Oh, there's a good one. Oh, I have to concentrate <laughs> on this fish. It's a good one too. <laughs> okay, the net for Dave. Sorry to interrupt you. Mm, look at that dude That's right that there. Dude. You know you're on Lake Erie when one guy's talking about his fish and uh, I hook up with another one. Nice. I'll hunt these bad boys any day of the week. Mm. Oh, one thing for sure, these fish are not tanking that bait. You put that little coffee tube down there and they smell it and they have to eat it. It's unbelievable. As you've heard Simon say, every single fish that we've marked has been belly on the bottom. Let me get this fish back in the water. And when you see fish on a graph where they're belly on the bottom like that, you always wanna be fishing a bait that's gonna be on the bottom. You're fishing a drop shot or even a crankbait that's gonna run over them. It's gonna be way above them. But this time of year, you wanna put something right in front of them. That little tube, just boom, 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 boom. And as you can see, they're eating. Let's get more. 